Hello everybody, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you Daily Bean and I've been using this application for a month. I decided to try it out kind of around the New Year's time because I know that's about when people start to, you know, like make their New Year's resolutions and all that kind of stuff. So this is a really cute tracking app that I was actually introduced to by a friend and so I decided I would kind of do a little thoughts and impressions video about it. So first off here, um, when you open the app for the first time, this is what you get. It says, what would you like to record? And it has like all of these um, different categories and you can like select what you want out of all of these to record and kind of personalize it to your needs and what you would like to track. And it doesn't matter if you click everything you want now because you can always customize it later. But then it's going to ask you if you want to allow notifications. Basically, it just reminds you to complete your um, daily recording if you forgot to or if you haven't already. And so you can just say next on that. And then it will ask you when you want to have a reminder. I just set mine to 1030 because that's kind of like when my day concludes I'm not going to be doing anything after that besides studying <laughs> and so here it's just showing that your free trial has begun so for the first seven days you'll get all features in daily bean um, and there's no automatic charges after the trial and so I noticed here yeah that one of the features you'll see this is that you can select up to three photos without that feature um, you can only select one for the free version so you'll see partway through that that changes but anyways you just select okay and that's basically it there's a theme store where you can make your little icons like cute and this was around you know december when i filmed this so it was all like christmasy um that the ones that they're advertising and so then once you get there then you're ready to go ahead and start recording so i'm just gonna go ahead and show you what that kind of looks like as you can see here this cuts to present day where I have filmed all of my beans for the month and we are good to go. You can kind of see um, the outline and how it looks and you can see the little icons of how I was feeling each day. And so if we go ahead and just move back to December really quick and then we click on a day, for example, we can click on the 17th. This is a day where uh, the free trial was counted so I was able to access all the premium features. You can see on the top there it lists all my like emotions that i put in and kind of like who i was with the weather and like what i did below it i inputted text so you can see that on the 17th i slept on the plane we did have a red eye flight i arrived in maryland i visited many national monuments i went shopping i took naps in all the car rides and i took 20 20 000 steps that day and you can see some photos that I inputted there. I was able to select three different photos. And if we move to a day that the free trial is over, such as Friday the 30th, for example, you can see that I can only select one photo there, but pretty much everything else is the same. And if you just click on the little icons on the top, you can kind of see the words for what each icon represents. And then if you just click that again, it goes away. And then so I'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like to record a bean so if you click on the day so today is saturday the 14th right and so then this is what pops up obviously the day is not over well you could think it's 10 30 p.m but actually when i'm filming this is 10 30 in the morning so what you do is you select your mood so for example you know oh today i was really happy right then you move down to your emotions and you select all of the ones that you feel so for example in this scenario i'm today i'm feeling excited and relaxed and happy and then for social i select oh you know friends for weather it is very much rainy outside i apologize if you can hear it i'm not sure if you're able to but it is quite loud and then for events i just stayed home school i just studied and then you could input your sleep so for example like 12 a.m to 8 a.m on solid eight hours um and then you select today's photo, reminder that it's only one photo, now that the seven day free trial is over. I'm not gonna do that for this purpose because that will just open my camera roll, but you can envision what that looks like. And then for today's note, you can literally write whatever you want here. You just start typing. I kind of do it in like bullet point format. Um, that's how I found to kind of be 
the easiest for me but you can write paragraphs you could do whatever you want and then after that you just press done and then that's literally it for the seven day free trial version there were no advertisements for the free version there are advertisements after you select done you just gotta watch it for a couple seconds and then you can exit out and then if you look in the top left hand corner though you can see a little gear where you can kind of customize things so if you go ahead and click on that you can see what you can customize so you can edit you can add edit or delete any icons here so for emotions for example i'm going to click on excited and you can change the icon the name of the icon you can move it to a different block hide it from records or just remove it permanently and if you scroll down here, you can see it's exactly the same for everything else. You can even create a new block. So this is what I was talking about earlier when it said that you can customize it later. So you can add things such as the items listed here. And that's pretty much that. You can also edit the order as well of icons. So for example, you're like, hey, I want to record events first before I record anything else. You just kind of drag it up to the top. And that just allows you to customize the order that you input things. But I'm just gonna go ahead and exit from this bean because I'm not gonna save it yet. But yeah, that's pretty much the end of this. This is what my daily bean looks like after using it for about a month. And I think it's a really cute app. If you want to kind of bullet journal in a way that is online and super simple, this is a great way to do it. The application's free you just have to deal with you know only selecting one photo and then also watching a couple advertisements but if that doesn't bother you at all then this is a perfect free application to use and i think it's super cute so that concludes this video um if you liked it please give it a thumbs up to let me know you can also hit the subscribe button down below because i post videos every single sunday and i hope to see you back again next week bye